friends, it's Quinn. Welcome back to my channel. I'm sure you're going to see a lot of these. Yes, it is that time for the Book Outlet Black Friday haul. I ordered a few books because, of course, as you know, during Black Friday, they super discount. They're already super discounted books, and they're basically like pennies at this point. And I saved up a couple buckaroos so I could spend them. Also, I want to thank the people at Book Outlet. I screwed up. Like, a few weeks before Black Friday, they had this opportunity where they would give you like a $5 um, coupon if you spent $20. And I messed up and I did sign up and I thought I did everything like to get my discount, but then I didn't. And I was super bummed and I was like, what the heck? So I contacted them and they are so nice, you guys. And they still gave me my $5 coupon. So shipping was $1.99 for this whole box of books. It is quite heavy. I don't even know how many pounds it is, but it's quite heavy. I think I got like four or five books and these are books that have been on my wish list and I have wanted for a while. I probably would have went a little bit more crazy, but books were selling out like hotcakes. So I had to get these while I could. Also, um, I did get my first ever scratch and dent book, so let's hope it's not scratched or dented too bad. Um, <laughs> I've never done a scratch and dent from them before, um, so, but it was like super cheap, so you know, what are you gonna do? But anyway, let's go ahead and get into this. It is an unboxing. I received this today, so I really have forgotten. I think I got the square root of summer and I got uh, shallow graves I think it's called and I don't really remember what else I got but it was some books on my wish list and they had them I wanted to get a court of thorns and roses but it sold out I wanted to get the rose and the dagger but <laughs> it was sold out there were so many things that I wanted that were sold out so these are the ones that I ended up with that I, I am happy about so let's go ahead and get into this a Black Friday book haul as always, they have this massive amount of paper. And then I have my slip of what I got. I got, oh, I actually got, <laughs> I got quite a bit more than I thought I did. I had eight books. <laughs> Four or five. <laughs> Okay, so I got The Shallow Graves by Jennifer Donnelly. I love it. It's hardcover, deckled pages. Let's check. Oh, map. Oh my God. And then, ooh, look at that. So pretty. And here's the spine. So it's nice and metallic -y. Yes, this will do just fine. Cover's kind of like got that creepy vibe going on. So I'm loving it. Yes. So I paid, let's see, for these shallow graves, $4.89 for that. And it originally retails for $19.99. So that's a steal. Like five bucks. I also got... Half Lost and Half Wild by Sally Green. This is the second and the third books in the Half Bad trilogy. Not really sure which order they come into. I think it's Half Wild, then Half Lost. Um, and I have <sighs> Half Bad right here on my shelf. So look how pretty those are together. So sparkly. I did enjoy this. It's more of a slow paced book. Um, so I'm hoping that I like these as well. So now I have the full trilogy. Yay! And these were, um, let's see, Half Wild was $3.49 and Half Lost was $5.59. So for $9, I got both books. So more paper. Oh, now here's something that upsets me. So I ordered The Sky is Everywhere, but the cover that I saw was this, which was very whimsical and dreamy and had never seen it before. And I really liked that cover. And I got this cover, which is like 
fine, it's great and all that, but I wish they would have let me know I was getting this cover. It seems like it's always a crapshoot with Book Outlet, but they're great people. So I'm really excited to have this one because I loved um, I'll Give You the Sun by Jandy Nelson. And I did like a whole nail art thing on it. And like, I just did a review on it, I think. I really liked it. And I've heard that this is just as good. And I, she wrote this one first. So yeah, I'm really excited to finally have this in my collection for discounted for... 244 come on 244 awesome pretty copy of love and gelato by jenna evans welsh and i just i got it for the cover i'm not gonna even lie i got it for the cover because it's so freaking cute so it's probably a contemporary and i remember reading what it was about way back in the day and i put it on my amazon wish list so when i saw it on book outlet snagged it up for 384. I got The Darkest Corners by Kara Thomas. This is another one that um, seemed kind of thrilling and spine tingling. Um, but yeah, I got this in hardcover as well. Sounds like, um, let's see, As Dark as Jillian Flynn as Compulsive as Serial. And I love that podcast, Serial. If you haven't watched, listened to it, oh my gosh, you have to. So if this is being compared to that, thumbs up for me. I think I might enjoy this one. And I got this one for $3.84. This is my scratch and dent, and I'm really sad. So I probably will not keep it because... I like the cover, so yeah. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. I'll probably just like donate it or something. But this is the square root of summer. I was hoping that the dust jacket was just a little ripped or something like that. But as with scratch and dent, sometimes you get the dust jacket, sometimes you don't. Sad it doesn't have the dust jacket, so I'll probably just donate this or give this to a friend and then actually buy the book myself. But um, it was a gamble, it was a gamble. And this was $3.49, so not a bad deal. Like, maybe I'll still read it and then see if I actually like it before I buy a full copy of the book. That's probably a good idea. And the last book that I got sounded really cool. I had, have never heard anything about it, um, but it's called The Man Who Loved Books Too Much, and it's the true story of a thief, a detective, and a world of literary obsession by Alison Hoover Bartlett, and it's actually like a true crime slash biography book about um, Gelke, who stole um, a fortune and rare books from around the country. Following this eccentric cat and mouse chase with a mixture of suspense, insight, and humor. Um, so yeah, it sounds, it sounds very interesting about someone that goes around like stealing all these rare books. I mean, it's kind of like, uh, like a book lover's worst nightmare. Um, but yeah, so it just sounded really interesting and I haven't read true crime in a while and I wanted to dive back into it. And I thought that this just sounded like a good fiction story, much less it like actually being true. So I'm really interested in this. If you've heard of this guy, um, let me know. His name is John Charles Gilkey and yeah it just sounds like really like a good book a good mystery but it's true so anyway these are the books that I got on Black Friday from Book Outlet I am a little bummed like I said about the square root of summer I'm really happy that I got all of these books super discounted and I will continue shopping at Book Outlet especially when they have Black Friday deals like this but that's all I have for you today I hope you've enjoyed and I'll see you again in my next video bye